Hallelujah. Hi, welcome in. This is the final reading for this book. God will bring about the appearing of our Lord Jesus Christ in his own time. God, the blessed and only ruler, the King of kings and Lord of lords, who alone is immortal and who lives in unapproachable light, whom no one has seen or can see, to him be honor and might forever. Amen. 1 Timothy 6 verses 15 to 16. When they saw the star, they rejoiced with exceedingly great joy. And when they had come into the house, they saw the young child with Mary, his mother, and fell down and worshipped him. Matthew 2 verses 10 to 11. A light from on high will dawn upon us and visit us to shine upon and give light to those who sit in darkness and in the shadow of death to direct and guide our feet in a straight line into the way of peace. Luke 1 verses 78 to 79. King Jesus, you are King of kings and Lord of lords. You dwell in unapproachable light. I'm grateful that you are also my shepherd, companion, and friend, the one who never lets go of my hand. I worship you in your holy majesty, and I draw near you to rest in your loving presence. I need you both as God and as man. Only your birth on the on that first long-ago Christmas, could meet all my needs. Instead of trying to comprehend your incarnation intellectually, I want to learn from the example of the wise men. They followed the leading of a spectacular star, then fell down in humble worship in your presence. Inspired by the Magi, I long to respond to the wonder of your holy birth with ardent adoration. Please help me grow in my capacity to worship you as my Savior, Lord, and King. You held back nothing in your amazing provision for me, and I rejoice in all that you are, all you have done. You are the light from on high that dawns upon us to direct and guide our feet into the way of peace. In your majestic name, amen.